Hello everyone, Mike Rempel from Excel Bytes with today's Excel Bytes tutorial. Today we're going to take a look at how to use the navigation option that's available in Excel. This will allow you to find and jump to any objects, tables, pivot tables, charts, images, shapes, etc. anywhere regardless of how many worksheets you have open. But before we jump into that, please take a minute to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Make sure you hit the bell icon so you will get a notice whenever I put out a new video. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also find me at any of the social media sites you see here. So now let's check out today's topic. So here I have a workbook with four worksheets, one, two, three, and four. On sheet one, I have an image or a picture that I imported. I have a triangle, I have a table, and I have a chart from that table. Sheet two has another table and a pivot table. Sheet three is blank, and sheet four has a data range that's a named range that I called company rank. So if I want to find any of these objects in my workbook, any of these items, what I would do is I can go to the View tab in the ribbon and there's an option in the Show block called Navigation. And if I click on that, notice a navigation pane appears on the far right. Now this can be a floating object. I can select it and move it around and it will stay on top of whatever worksheet that I'm at. I can then dock it back if I want to put it here. Notice it has all the different sheets of my workbook and if I expand them all you can see that it will show the different type of objects that I have on each one of those sheets. I can move it, resize it, or close it and I can also search for an item. So for example if I searched for profit Notice sheet two with the table profit pops up and it went right to that sheet. I'm going to clear that out and again it will then expand and show all the different items that I have in my workbook. If I want to choose a triangle shape that I have, click on that. It will take me to sheet one and highlight or select that shape that I've just chosen. Sheet 3, notice, has nothing, so even though when I try to expand it, nothing will show up. And Sheet 4 has just that name data range that we have, and if I chose that, it would jump right to Sheet 4 and highlight that range. So this is how you can easily navigate through your workbook to find different items that you have in Excel.